Here's a small project I did that tests a chronodot. Not that we expect many failures, but we do expect a large shipment in pretty soon, and it's always good to have a quick way to test these things. So uh, this is a little 3D printed enclosure. It was drawn in SketchUp and uh, exported to an STL and then printed on my 3D printer. And the code is running on an ATtiny25, which is a small 8-bit AVR. And I'm actually programming that with uh, the Arduino Tiny library and also the uh, Tiny Wire M library. So very simple little project, just accesses the chronodot, uh, reads a few registers, and then uh, sets the status of the LEDs depending on uh, whether chronodot has had any errors or not. So you just turn it on. And the flashing indicates that uh, there's some kind of an error or it wasn't able to successfully communicate. So just plug it in. And it's just ticking back and forth. So we only have a good chrono dot. There's a 9 volt battery inside there. Uh, pull it off. Error mode again. So that's it. Very handy little project. Made possible by open source software. Programmed with a, an Adafruit. USB tiny ISP